I'm Lacey. I am a self-diagnosed IFUSE success story. I was a pre-K special ed teacher and I fell chasing a runaway child. I was a new mother of a five-month-old at the time that I fell and my suffering was to the point that I couldn't even take care of my own child. And being a first-time mom, that was detrimental. I mean, that was something I, I would never wish on anyone. And not being able to take care of him and, and having to basically ship him off to the grandparents, it was awful. I was unable to rock my child, which I loved doing. That was my favorite thing to do. I was absolutely miserable. Driving hurt, sitting hurt, lying down hurt. Everything was extremely painful. I was at a constant eight and nine pain scale. I was limited to crutches. I would take baths to hopefully relieve some pain and would feel helpless because I would get stuck in the bath and needed help just getting myself up and getting up the stairs and into the bed. I saw numerous physical therapists. I was given numerous SI belts, which would help, but only temporary. So along this journey of doctors and therapists telling me there's really nothing wrong with me, I was relentless in researching and basically figuring out the answer because pain management was not the route I was taking. So I found Dr. Lorio researching uh, doctors in Nashville, doctors in Memphis. Dr. Lorio was one of two that came up in Nashville. Somehow I just had a gut feeling that I liked this doctor. Could be that he's triple board certified. I, I don't really know, but I I'm so glad that I did. When I first met Dr. Lorio, I, I told him, you can call me crazy. That is an answer, but tell me something. And he said, you're not crazy. Th this is definitely an issue. You have sacroiliitis to the point that surgery is your best option. He spent several hours with us the very first initial visit explaining the procedure, what to expect. So after my IFUSE procedure, I knew that my pain was completely gone. That one pain in my buttock was no longer there. And I was walking pretty much five days post-op. 10 days post-op, I went to church, and I remember sitting in the car, looking up at my church, and realizing that I had zero pain. And normally, I would have pain just sitting in the car with the vibration. That's when I realized this worked. This is it. Today, I am a little under five months post-op. I have my child back at home with me full-time. I can lift him, I can throw him in the air, I can crawl with him. I basically have my life back. 